Um, happy Monday. We are going to be showing you what you're doing for Tuesday's workout. Um, so we obviously had a nice long aerobic piece today. So tomorrow we're going to slow it down a little bit, get a little bit of strength in. So uh, whatever kind of weight or equipment you have at home is fine. If for some reason that does not work out for you, just let me know um, and we'll figure out a plan for you. Um, so quick warm up today and then we'll go into some movement priming tomorrow. Sorry, Tuesday. Um, so Abby is here demoing for me. So she's gonna go through the movements as I talk. Um, so first part of the warm up is gonna be three rounds. She's gonna do 10 push ups. Good, nice tight plank. Remember, we can go from our knees if we need to, just keeping that nice straight line. Um, and if she needs to, she can warm up. So do a full one and just warm up. All right. And then if you guys have a box, a bench, couch, wall, all of that is acceptable as well. So just get that pressing warmed up a little bit. Um, and then she's going to do 10 Kang squats. So she's going to combine that good morning with a back or with a squat. So good morning, squat, good morning, stand back up. All right. So remember with that good morning, let's keep that back nice and flat. Um, don't round it. Um, that should get your entire backside nice and warm. All right, then we're gonna do five reps of each movement going into the workout. Um, so our three movements today are gonna to be a bent over row, a floor press, and a single leg RDL. So that bent over row, she's gonna give me a slight knee bend, nice flat back, and then she's gonna pull that weight all the way up into her chest. So think about pulling right to your sternum. Obviously that's not a barbell today, um, but same, same movement pattern, good. So nice and controlled, you guys, this is not for speed. Five each arm, good. All right, and then uh, side floor press. So she's gonna lay on her back. Just like a bench press, you guys, but laying on the floor. She's gonna let that arm come all the way flat to the ground, and then she's gonna press all the way up. All right, so she's gonna do five each arm for the warm up, making sure that weight is appropriate. And then moving on to single leg RDL. So for right now, um, if she doesn't wanna use the weight yet, that's totally okay. Um, she's going to get that hip hinge warmed up. So for this one, we want to make sure that it's a, a hip hinge. She's going to do five each leg. A lot of balance here, you guys. Um, so feel free to take your time. If it means that you're not actually using weight for this, that's totally okay. Um, when you do pick up an object, you can keep it in opposite hand or the same hand, whichever works best for your balance. All right, and you should feel a nice good stretch um, down the back of your hamstring for this. All right, you guys, so then our uh, workout is five rounds for quality, um, 10 reps each arm or leg. So every time you hit a movement, you're doing 20 total reps between your limbs. Um, the first movement is 10 bent over rows for right arm, then 10 for your left arm. Then moving on to 10 floor press, 10 for your right arm, 10 for your left arm. Remember, still keeping that belly nice and tight, not letting that lower back arch off the ground. And then finally ending with 10 single leg RDL each leg. Again, um, if you don't need to use a weight, that's totally okay. You guys can still continue to work on balance. I promise you'll get something out of it. Otherwise, opposite or same hand is fine. <laughs> yeah, they're tough. Um, and then rest two minutes between rounds. So five total rounds, 10 reps each arm or leg, um, and then two minute rest between. All right, you guys, have a great day. Have